Hey guys, welcome back to Battle Cats. Today is the day. I finally have enough behemoth stones to evolve Cinnabar Egg into Courier Cat. Now as you can see here guys, just like every other egg, all it says is true form evolution reveals its final form also gains Behemoth Slayer. But that's not all. Something else happens to this guy when you evolve him that makes him one of the best anti-red units in the entire game. Allow me to show you what I mean. Just gotta get this guy to level 30. And then, boom, pow. Check it out. It goes from being a useless egg to this guy. Wow, check it out guys, it's Courier Cat. You guys have been asking me so much about Courier Cat. Matt, when are you gonna get Courier Cat? I need to do more grinding, guys. I was just on vacation, um, and I didn't even have Battle Cats with me, so I'm gonna have to, you know, try and get ahead a little bit more. But anyway, so here's Courier Cat, a cat that honors the lives of delivery men that lived long ago. Currently delivering very fragile goods, massive damage to red enemies, Behemoth Slayer. But what else? Take a look at this. What's that? Long distance? Huh? This guy has massive damage versus red enemies and it's a long distance area attack, which is not a common thing in this game. Let's read the wiki. And just so you guys know, I won't be looking at anything on this wiki today involving hacked or modded units because I got a copyright strike from Ponos themselves for taking a look at the wiki entry for Cheetah Cat. Now I've been talking to my contact at Ponos and he said he's gonna get that strike removed, but it hasn't been removed yet. So Ponos, anytime, that'd be great. I'm probably gonna be taking down the video on Cheetah Cat once the strike is removed, guys. So you probably still won't be able to find it, but it would be really great if I didn't have the copyright strike. Okay, so normal slash evolve form, we all know that they're useless, that's the whole point, it's just an egg, but the true form. Once the egg hatches, the unit that comes out turns out to be one of the most powerful anti-red rare cats. Hmm. Obviously, it's not gonna be as powerful as an uber, we all know that. Courier Cat with his long distance and high DPS, a rare combination, does especially well on stages that feature mostly or only red enemies. All I can think of is Cappy. Cappy, I'm gonna kill you. Obviously, we're gonna have to uh, use a bunch of meat shields when we use this guy, but he should really come in handy. It also says here that he synergizes amazingly with Sushi Cat, which I believe, because Sushi Cat can just sit there, you know, Row Cat can just sit there and uh, take crazy amounts of damage from red enemies. This guy has a short recharge time and decent range, which allows him to be stacked easily, not to mention the long distance, allowing for burst damage approaches as well. Hmm. Uh, and also apparently the Behemoth Slayer is good. It makes his stats very high against Behemoths with a chance to avoid taking damage. It's like a 5% chance of just not getting hit. This is what I care about, guys, the fact that he's good against Kasori and Ahirujo, because that uh, red bird thing kind of sucks. Okay, guys, I think the first thing I'm gonna do here, since I have 56 rare cat size, is I'm gonna give this guy some more levels. I don't know how many I should give him. I'm really tempted to bring him all the way to level 50 so he can really pack a punch. But let's go to level 40 for now. Just in case you guys don't think I should use all my rare cat size on this guy. I don't know what else to do with them. Probably level up some other rares that I use all the time. All right, there you go, buddy. Level 40, not bad. Who else is level 40 here? We got, uh, you're level 35. Jelly Cat's level 50, guys. I really cranked this guy up because I love him. So anyway, guys, now we're gonna try this guy out in some levels and see how he does. There are a couple of things on right now that I could do. There's the Hidden Force of Gapra, which would be nice because we can fight, oh wait, what? No, no, where's the guy? I thought this was the one where I could fight the red thing. Well, there are actually a lot of red stages on guys right now. Like, like this is basically all of the red stages. So we'll try some of them out, okay? First of all, let's, uh, let's get some uh, nets. See, we might be able to get that last bug hero. By the way, guys, one more thing. 
I am a member of the officers club now, okay? So I get the uh, like daily cat food and I have unlimited speed ups. So that's kind of nice. So let's uh, let's get in here, grab some of these nets and uh, probably gonna do some uncanny legends after that. Oh God, I forgot about this. Okay, check this guy out. All right, there he is. He has a blind spot. So let's hope that uh, let's hope that he doesn't get anything in the blind spot. That's a nice little area attack you got there, buddy. D he doesn't seem like that long range to me. What is he? Is he thro he's throwing a black cat? These darn stages. I still don't like them. Okay, I still think that they're super weird. But anyway, let me help you out there, buddy. Let me give you a couple things. Do you need it? You probably don't need. There you go. You did it. Great job, little buddy. Haven't done stylish hideout in this form before, guys. This one is the uh, normal Enigma, and it's evening time. I might get two for this. So, yeah. Range-wise, I guess we're gonna see how he does on some of these red enemies. Well, I have six of these, so two more draws and I'm guaranteed a bug hero, but uh, I have a feeling that it's gonna be one that I already have. I wanna get Kuwagata Cat. Okay, so I can have all three of the ones in this event. Let's see what we get. Not Kuwagata. Is that Kuwagata cat, guys? Did I actually do it? Oh man, I actually did it. And now I don't have to worry about these things anymore. Nice. Oh, and an, oh, that's uh, Kabuto cat as well. Okay, I'll just give you a plus one here, buddy. You're welcome. And some XP, XP, speed up. Speed up? Bro! I'm an officer! Somebody said there's an update coming out, guys, that's gonna allow you to use your existing speed ups if you're in the officer's club to triple speed things. So that would be interesting. There's my Kuwagata cat, 50,000 XP, thanks. And then here is our Kuwagata cat, and also our brand new, well, he's not gonna show up as a new cat, is he? That's not him. That's not him. That's him right there, okay. It's an interesting little attack, man. Just throwing those black cats. Are the, are the black cats the evil cats, guys? I have a killer cat of my own, so not necessarily. Okay, so let's take a look here, guys. I, I still need four more behemoth culling stages. Unique behemoth culling stages, right? Yeah, for the first time. All right, well, this'll be, this'll be one of them anyway. The Hidden Forest of Gapra, Woodlands Area 4. I hope that the, the red dude is in here. And actually, if he is, I should probably have myself a row cat as well. What you got for me? Eh? Definitely not gonna get that guy. We're not, we're not, we're not gonna get the, the guy I wanna get. Now, is this guy, is he technically a behemoth? Well, nice little attack there, buddy. You seem to have uh, done the trick on that one, so that's cool. Keep that up, I guess. I don't get too close. Yeah, I, I, I guess he's long range because his area attack extends out. Something like that, because in terms of his actual range, it's not that amazing. And as for stackability, guys, he takes about twice as long as a meat shield. Maybe three times as long as a meat shield to come back. Okay. Hey, we, we actually do have this guy. Check it out. So let's see how easy it is to defeat him when we got this guy throwing cats at him. You want some of it? He's gone. Bye-bye. All right, well that was nice, wasn't it? Yeah, cause I really don't like that bird, man. Oh, what's this? Affliction in the forest. The strongest behemoth, what are you talking about, man? Oh, okay. Um, strongest behemoth. This guy apparently struggles with the uh, the big crab guy, you know, the, the, the blue crab behemoth. So if it's him, We'll still be able to hurt him, but we'll also take damage as well. Here you go, buddy. Just throw those cats. Oh, well, watch it. You better be careful. I, uh, I don't want to push too much here, you know? I'm just, just trying to kind of take it easy. Oh, God. Look out, courier. Oh, boy. Um, wait. Where, where behemoth? That guy's not a behemoth, is he? I don't know. Let's throw some cats at him, I guess. See what happens, you know? See, see if we can't kill him with some cats. Okay, so that guy's dead. That was fine. I didn't I didn't know he was a behemoth. I guess he must be, right? Unless there's something else coming out here. 
There's nothing else coming out here. Okay. Very good then. Very good. That's the first clear on that one, and I got nothing for it. And now that's gone. Well, it did say nothing here, but that's supposed to unlock new stuff for me or something, right? All right, guys, I'm gonna jump into Uncanny Legends now, and maybe we'll get some red units in here that we can uh, kill with Courier Cat. I did a stream uh, last week where I uh, worked on some Uncanny Legends, so I'm a couple more chapters ahead now, but I still have, like, most of them to do. Okay, so these aren't starting off too great. I, uh, I'm gonna look and see what's in each level because I don't feel like going in there and uh, wasting my energy. These cost quite a bit to do. Uh, and this is a, a zombie stage, so I'm sure it'll be fine. We do have to deal with that guy, but uh, it is what it is, you know? Tell you what I want. I want myself a ganglion. I want a gangle on him. Okay, that's a couple of ducks, guys. I gotta be careful here. I don't want them ducks killing me because I know they will. We killed them first. Good. Okay, a couple of things there. Oh, no. We gotta be careful, guys. There's freaking zombies behind us. You're not supposed to be behind me, zombies. Well, it's exactly what you're supposed to do, technically. But don't do it. These guys actually seem to have quite a lot of health on them, huh? Have you thought about dying? Ganglion is just far enough away from this uh, grave to not take any damage from them. Oh, my God. Can somebody do something about that thing? At our base. He's still there, man. What? Okay. Dude, seriously, can you chill out, take it easy, stop hurting me so much? Somebody kill this thing already. It's getting ridiculous. Okay, that was not a full kill. You, uh, He's back. Listen, I don't got time for another ganglion. I'm leaving. I hate you. Okay, let's take this out. Can we get like a, another anti- Zombie, I know, I know who to pick. I know who to pick, don't worry. Housewife cat, guys. Housewife cat, she is the one. She's a good lady, she can jump right over that hand sticking out of the ground. Okay, I'm just gonna have to play a little more aggressively this time. Maybe I won't focus on the, uh, the Ubers so much, okay? Maybe I'll just spam this stuff, make sure I got my housewives going here. You got this, housewife. That, those savage blows are the best thing ever. I just love the sound of them, okay? I used to love the sound of the critical hit um, and the uh, and the zombies dying, and those are still great noises, but nowhere near as good as the savage blow noise. Just need a little bit more. Boom! Let's go. Let's go. Now, I know they're touching the base, but it's going to be okay. Give it your best shot. Enough, enough uh, housewife attacks. Savage blows and all. Gonna do this. Gonna do it. Just fine. Kai is useless here, guys. I shouldn't have taken her with me again because she gets knocked back by this guy every time. I mean, I guess Kai would be okay for the uh, for the tunneling ducks, but... Ugh. Boom! And you're dead. Told you housewife could do the trick, guys. She is wonderful. All right. A couple more savage blows there on the way out. We're good. The next one is uh, all aliens, so that's fun. So guys, I now have the true form of sharpshooter slash night hunter Saki. It's a uh, bad blaster Saki, and she only hits aliens and relic. It was aliens and red, then aliens and zombie, and now it's aliens and relic. So uh, let's uh, give her a shot. She's already in the loadout, so we're gonna give her a shot, but she should be fun. We got our catalyte so that we don't get warped here. Break that, slow this guy down, all is well. Okay, I don't think I'm gonna have any trouble with this one, guys, especially with this long-ranged uh, Aphrodite over here. You're usually laughing when it comes to any aliens in her. But then again, they're getting pretty close to her. Better get a Saki out here to shoot some people. Look at her, man, look at that gun. Oh, it's so beautiful. Do it again. That's right, boom. I love the attack, man. Big explosion. Okay, we're definitely... You're definitely getting a little too close here, folks. Back it up, please. I don't have any anti traitless and you know how these reindeer are. They're really good at covering that distance. Yeah, I have very little that can actually deal with these guys right now. Amaterasu is, is mostly doing it. And then she died! Man, can you guys just take a break? This is not good. This is not good at all. Oh my god. Get on up out of here. Don't be like this. 
No, no, no! No! What the heck? I don't like Uncanny Legends anymore, guys. Friendship ended with Uncanny Legends, even though I didn't have a friendship with it in the first place, but you know what I mean. I guess I'll take out Amaterasu and I'll put in Gao. Okay, or maybe we should do Is. Maybe that's a good idea. We should try out some of these new Ubers that I have, okay? It's expensive to level her up, but it's cool. That's the best we can do. Oh, actually, that's level 30. <laughs> well, that's the best anyone can do. We'll give you one more. Two more, okay? People keep going on about how great is is. I pushed too hard here, didn't I? Really feel like I pushed too hard. And here we are. Okay, well, you and you, maybe together with some meat shields, we can uh, do this, okay? Look at that! Look at you going crazy over here. Before you got, wait, did you get warped? You're powered up. Does that mean you're close to death? Hope you're not close to dying. That wouldn't be good. Going to town. Okay, it died. Maybe it would have been better to... Wait, back again? Oh my god, guys. No wonder you guys like this thing. That's a pretty nice recharge, I'll tell you that. Oh, guys. I made a mistake. Is the alluring dancer is not an anti list. It's an anti-traded. Big difference. I, I was just thinking that it was traitless because of, you know, Gao being right next to it. Not a smart line of thinking. Well, it is fun to watch. Look at that thing dancing around here. Man, they don't want me to fight any red enemies, guys. They're giving me really weird stages. Standing Sana does not sound like a great time. Uh, zombie and black and relic. I can, I can deal. Okay. Starting off pretty chill. No, oh, okay. No, that's fine. You're good. See? And you can probably kill them pretty well too, yeah. Okay. You guys are too fast now, okay? You gotta you gotta watch it. You're gonna You're gonna hit the base. You hit the base. Okay. Hold on. I got it. It's cool. Here, have a dancer. And let's see how that does when it comes to stomping on these uh uh the otters. Are you stomp I think I think the otters just got stomped, guys. I'm not really sure. Here we go, guys. Stomping again. Never hurts to get stomping, right? There you go. Stomp that elephant to death. That's usually an elephant's job, stomping other people to death, you know? Other people? Elephants aren't people. It's usually an elephant's job to stomp things to death. There. Definitely an interesting unit, guys. For sure. Hey, here we go, guys. We got some red in here, okay? So we get to actually use our dude. Zombie, black, and red, which means that we can kind of just... Uh, do what we're doing here. Let's take this guy out because it's a zombie duck, okay? And we'll put in our new uh, guy. Level 40 courier cat ready to curry, okay? Courier? Barely even know her! Oh, oh, sending out some seals, are ya? Wait, are these like boosted seals or something? It doesn't say they're boosted. I'm pretty sure this isn't even a hard stage, but uh, either way, we got something, you know? Either way, we got our little dude here, and he's gonna throw some cats. Throw some cats, throw some shade. There you- Oh, man! So fast. It's gonna be a little more complicated now, though. I don't know, like, can we take out this boar without a row cat? Oh, boy. It doesn't seem like it, does it? You better watch it. You better watch it. Okay. Row cat. If we had a row cat, it would've been fine. Look! They told me that it synergizes well with Rokat, guys. I should have just had Rokat in here too, okay? But I didn't. Oopsie daisies. Pretty sure this means that I can probably just use one meat shield here and then get this guy going, right? There you go. Man, that is good. Because, because you know, it, it weakens him as well. So the fact that, that uh, Rokat can weaken and also can be strong against this guy such a double whammy, man. Now, we gotta, we gotta watch it here, because we got more stuff coming around. But that boar ain't gonna bother us. He's gonna be so dead. There we go. So dead. Let's go. Woo! I need some more of that, guys. I need some more red units to, uh, to do the synergy with. It was, it was fun. No more red units, guys. And actually, the last level in this one is disgusting. But let's do, uh, 
Um, um, Umi Bozu's house first. I think we can just keep the same loadout on here and get back in. Now, probably would help to have some anti-traitless here, but whatever. We're gonna be okay. That is a lot of uh, dudes. Luckily, we've got we've got the courier who's got that area attack, and he can clean those up pretty quick. And they give us a lot of money, so clearly we're gonna have to use it or something. Probably don't want to put out Rokat now, huh? Probably not gonna help. We seem to be holding them off pretty well, but if we could just kill this Anteater, I think that would be kind of nice. There you go. Wave attacks, man. Mmm. Took my eyes off the screen for one second, and now I'm being bombarded by like a dozen dogs. Really? Really? Guys, this is so many dogs. This is ridiculous. Oh my god. No. No. Too many dogs. Okay, I didn't know you could have too many dogs. Stomp on those dogs, please. I don't want to lose because it is. Keep stomping. Oh my god. I I am out of spam, guys. I don't know what to do here. I'm trying to. Pizza Cat, can you do a wave attack, dude? Seriously. Oh boy. Are we gonna are we gonna lose because of this, guys? I'm trying my best here. I'm clicking as fast as I can, but there's just so many dogs. The dog spam is not okay. Oh. Jeez Louise. Okay, I can't believe that happened. Okay, here, uh, I'm, gonna, I'm gonna do it. I'm putting in another meat shield, okay? And I'm getting rid of this guy again, and I'm putting in my slime cat. My level 50 good boy. I'm actually gonna use him in the slime cat form this time, just for fun, okay? Jelly cat gets too much of the attention because he's a second form, even though he doesn't do anything. Okay, he's an imposter. He's sussy. See, this, this level was made for waves, guys. Like, come on. That's where the fun's at here. You just do it again. Save up money. You guys are not gonna get me twice with this crap, okay? Look at that. Boom. I'm done. Maxed out. We're making progress. We're making some headway. You better... You better, you better not. I don't like it when they make me angry, guys. Then I, then I start really uber carrying. Okay. You don't want to see me at 100% uber carry. What I'm actually going to do here, guys, is I am going to throw in a cyborg for the spam. Okay. With, with, with the cyborg spam, I think we'll be okay. I don't know if we, uh, what else do we want to do here? I don't think Can Can's doing too much, so let's see if we can get a good anti-black instead. I think probably just Amaterasu, honestly. It's uh, it's hard to argue against her. So let's just bring a cat CPU this time. We can save up money at the beginning and then hopefully just let it go after that. And it'll spam enough cyborgs that we win. That's that's the hope here. No, don't you, don't do nothing yet. Here comes the dogs. So you can go ahead and do that. And then cat CPU. Didn't even put everything out. Come on, there you go. Okay. We're good. Everything's fine. You're gonna have so many cy uh, cyborgs. You're gonna be like, wow, look at all the cyborgs. How's it looking? Looks pretty good, doesn't it, guys? Looks pretty good. We're not, they're not going anywhere. Okay. It's, it's the cyborg stack. Cyborg stacks are scary, okay? And I've, I've kind of not even used cyborg that much in a long time. Doesn't mean cyborg isn't still an amazing thing to spam. You're not getting through this, okay? Look, there's just a constant stream of cyborgs coming. As soon as we kill this ant, there you go. It's over, move along, get in here. That's a little wave attack. Bam, 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 bam. Umi Bozu, how dare you make me do that? I'm sorry it had to happen. I know what to do here. We're gonna be okay. This is gonna be an anti-relic and anti-angel uh, situation. So we got our slapsticks here. We'll keep this guy in here. You're always good. You can probably go. We got some nice anti-relics here already. But let's get uh, uh, Time Traveler Cat and then our, uh, our special weapon for angels, which is Benkai. I got, I got quite a few cat size guys, it's just that I never know what to use them for. I try and only use 
upgrades like this when they're necessary, like when I'm on a certain level and I really want to beat that level and can't. Okay, and then we go to our legend rare and we get ourselves a uh, Bankai. You know what, Bankai? I'll tell you something. You should also be level 35 because you are an absolute champ. Okay. Here comes me! And here's you! What do you want? Yeah? What you walking over here for? You trying to start something, bro? You trying to start something with me? Oh, I put it in the wrong unit there. I wanted this guy. Go, go, gadget time traveler. Don't touch the base. That is not okay. In a world of blurry, pixelated cats, be a time traveler, okay? This guy comes from a, a world where uh, blurry, pixelated cats are not okay. And we died. We're dead. Okay. Should have, uh, should, uh, should have, should have not sucked so much, to be honest. Right, get out here. Hurry. Okay, you did absorb that attack, but, uh, crap. Okay, this is not good, because they gonna come for me. They gonna run real fast, and they gonna hurt me. No, hey, get the heck out of here, dude. We're not ready for this at all. You're hurting me. Okay, okay. Again, I didn't mean to, I didn't mean to rush. I'm sorry. Okay, we're at level six. I think, I think that's a pretty good spot to stop and make sure we have enough saved up, you know? Cause it's no good to go upgrading your wallet now if it's gonna mess you up later. Okay, see if I upgraded now, I'd just be losing money. And these guys are probably gonna cause some trouble. Okay, I'm gonna start meat shielding now, okay? Cause that's gonna be important there. And let's get Bankai, and then I'm a Terrasu. Okay, now we should be able to do some damage. Knock him back. I know Bankai's not gonna hurt the puffer fish too much, but he could still do some damage to it. Honestly, guys, this stage basically screams, save some money and then take on the boss. And if you do that, it seems to go a lot better. Failing is just uh, winning with extra steps, guys. Everyone knows that. All right. Getting good XP from this anyway. I wish I could get some sprockets though. I need sprockets. All right, guys, so that's basically it. I just wanted to check out Courier Cat and maybe make a little bit of progress in Uncanny Legends. There are obviously more eggs as well that require Behemoth Stones. Haniwa, that's one of them. We also have Exorcist Cat that we can get. And we've got Cat Cactus, which is, whoa, a really difficult one to get. And there's Cinnabar Egg 202 now. And that one is for the uh, Armored Firefly. As for rares, obviously we have Courier Cat from Cinnabar Egg, and then we've got uh, Cat Tarzan, who I could get right now if I want. I don't know if that's the best time to use these stones up, but that's a thing that I can do in the next episode if you guys want. And we also have Black Egg and 103. I want this guy because he looks really cool. Gas Mask Cat. Any of these worth getting, guys? Let me know down below in the comments, and if there's any other Cats you think I should level up, maybe get a true form of, yada, yada, yada. I obviously have tons, okay? There's so many Ubers that I haven't even gotten past level 10. So there might be some good ones that'll help me in the future. Anything you guys want to say down below in the comments, go ahead and say it. If you have requests for future videos or cats that you want me to take a look at, please let me know. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I will see you next time. Goodbye.